Lydia the gold. I seen a lot of the comment on the last video that I uploaded. You know, I just shared a dream that I had about Christian Rock. I'm not a preacher. I'm not a prophet or a saint. Like, I'm just me, you know? Like, I believe in God. I love God. And God gifted me with dreaming. A lot of the dreams that I have usually do come to pass um i've already prayed and rebuked the spirit of, i prayed against the spirit of death you know i'm not wishing death on anyone like i said in the dream it did not have to be a physical death um i do believe that the death is spiritual regarding Krishan rock and it also like i said also in the video could just be a warning to me or anyone that you know just go and spend time with a loved one just period before a physical or spiritual death you know um sometimes god will speak to us in code so i just felt led to share that dream i usually don't share my dreams um I'm very, I'm a very private person, especially when it comes to the things going on in my physical and spiritual life. Um, I'm now just being more transparent. And, you know, my mom, she told me actually, shout out to her to share the dream. And I also just learned from my past experiences. Usually when I feel like I have to urgently do something, you might want to just follow your gut because also at that I'm reading in the comments is that a lot of people have either had the same dream or has heard the similar thing to what I said in the dream. So it actually reached a lot of people. A lot of people are thinking or feeling the same thing. So yeah, in the last dream that I posted, I waited a year to post that dream when I really should have posted it on time. Like when you get a urgent feeling or like if God like is giving you like a warning, like if it's a dream that you just know is like just out of the ordinary, share that dream. Like it's no point in waiting. You know, I'm, I'm just I'm like being more open now. Like I used to be very much private with my dreams and the things that I'm going through in life just, you know, to protect myself because I know that I'm gifted. I know God has a purpose and a plan for my life, but I have restrained um, and held back from sharing a lot of things with you guys because I guess because of fear of being judged or because of fear, because I know a lot of people either going to get it or not get it. And I'm not claiming myself to be somebody I'm not, you know. I still struggle with sin. And, like, if you pay attention to my videos, I clearly said in that video, like, I'm not even sure why God put it on my heart to share this dream because I'm not perfect myself. Like, I would straight up tell you that I'm not trying to pretend to be perfect and holy and godly. Like, so I don't need nobody in my comments, like, ever trying to, like, condemn me or judge me like as if I'm trying to be this false prophet or you know or point fingers like I'm never the one to point fingers because I'm always aware before anybody could tell me you know I'm always aware that I have my own things so you know I'm just addressing everything now um in this episode but yeah like I don't ever want y'all to think I am somebody I'm not. I'm growing. I'm getting close to God. You know, I'm just out there to reach the people that are just like me, that are trying to get closer to God, that wants to get closer to God, that seeks Jesus Christ and just wants the truth ultimately. You know, the more y'all listen to me and the more you go back and watch my videos and the more you continue to watch my videos, then you will really get a better understanding of who I am. And, you know, who I do it for. So, when it comes to celebrities, me having dreams about celebrities, let me tell you why I even have those dreams and why I share those dreams. Those of you may or may not know that I am a music artist. My dream 
my entire life has to become famous or be known for something good you know i have musical talents i'm very multi-talented um in many areas such as acting um being creative creative arts singing music um things like that so when it comes to celebrities y'all i found out a lot about different celebrities that while i was on my journey to seeking jesus christ god revealed a lot of things to me about these people that i thought i could look up to and so i feel like that's why they pop in my dreams because i at one point really studied these people so i could be just like them but since god has gifted me with a certain gift it's like god will always reveal to me the truth about anything because that's what i pray for that's what i ask for is the truth so when i make these vids i'm not pointing fingers i'm simply just sharing with you all um what god is sharing with me you know i'm learning and finding this stuff out just like you guys are you know it's like i'm just the messenger so I have studied a lot of celebrities because I wanted to be just like them at one point. But God revealed to me that they're not of God. And God showed me that I have another calling other than being a famous celebrity in a, 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 a industry plan or industry puppet, whatever. Like, God has a bigger plan for me. So, you know, I used to have this dream where I said, well, you know what? I'm just going to fake it till I make it. You know, I'm going to just do the worldly stuff, get popular and get known. And then once I get famous, then I'm going to revert to Christian music or then I'm going to start spreading the gospel. I had this all planned out, you know, but then it was just like God kind of took over what I was trying to do. And that's why that video about Krishan Rock was important because God is basically showing me as well as anyone who watched the video that you cannot serve two gods. So if anybody felt condemned or like I was trying to point a finger, that take that up with God. Because if anything, I'm condemning myself when I make these videos. Y'all got to be a little bit open minded. Like I'm never one to like judge anyone. When you watch my videos, it's literally me telling you my story. You know what I'm saying? And if I have a dream about somebody else, they're still a reflection of me. So regardless of whatever, we are all one. We have different parts in the body of Christ, but we all are one body. So I just wanted to get that out. You know what I'm saying? Um, stay tuned for the next vid that I'll be uploading. Thanks for watching. Thanks for tuning in. God bless y'all. Happy New Year. And I love y'all. See ya.